Just miles from the West Virginia-Virginia state line and nestled in the Blue Ridge Mountains sits Gathright Dam, quietly holding back the flow of water from the Jackson River. It's an earth field dam. Uh, you can see the outer shell is uh, of rock. There enter, the next layer in would be a, a smaller stone, then a gravel type, and then the impervious clay core center. The 257-foot dam has been in place for more than 30 years, and over that span it has protected communities downstream from damaging floods and has created one of the best trout fishing spots in Virginia. The fish do spawn in there and reproduce naturally because of the water quality. In order to ensure the safety of the communities downstream, engineers from the Corps of Engineers perform inspections twice a year. Each time they don their gear and venture into exploratory adits along the side of the dam and eventually they venture into the outflow tunnel which typically has 180 cubic feet a second of water running through it. Shutting down the dam allows inspectors to climb inside and get a visual look to see how well the dam is holding up. Basically we just look for um, scarring uh, on the walls or um, you know, any damage inside and then just um, monitor the drains. The dam is only shut down long enough for engineers to get their visual inspections completed so that businesses downstream who rely on a constant flow of water aren't impacted. A process that has been completed time and time again with what engineers consider a successful result. The trends we've seen, it's uh, there's been no unexpected changes. A finding that doesn't surprise dam supervisor Bill Seipel, who helped to build the dam as a contractor. It was built right and it's here to stand the test of time and it'll take whatever you know we put in here against it from allegheny county virginia patrick bloodgood